How's it going guys? Welcome back to another JHR review. And today we're going to be looking at Cup of Doodles. This is a doodle draw and create kit. And it's kind of nostalgic, kind of reminds me of when I was younger. And basically this comes with a little kit of a bunch of stuff that you can do, fill on the lines and I think even uh, connect the dots as well. So without further ado, let's go ahead and open this up and see what comes in this little kit. I love the colorful design. It says the piggy story on the top. I believe that is the brand actually. I'm gonna open this. Comes with a few interesting things in here. Move that to the side. First of all, it comes with a little book it looks like. Oh, so this is pretty cool. I really like alpacas. So if you look right here, it has a whole little kind of color in alpaca like little scene right here with a cute little cactus and uh little kind of wearing sweaters and stuff so that's pretty cool and the back is blank line details done pretty good we have a little b interesting little uh zigzag lines that you can color in like i said the cactus actually has faces on it Looks as though everyone's having a conversation of some sort. That guy looks like he has some kind of uh, ear decoration. But yeah, let's move that out of the way. It comes with some cute little crowns. We got a brown, green, blue, purple, red, and a uh, orange. Kind of looks like a pinkish red almost. And then right here, it actually kind of shows like the colored in scene, the other uh, page I just showed you guys. And this is actually looks to be a little book. So you can fill in everything right here. We got a copy of, uh, actually no, this is a brand new scene it looks like. I like all of the little smaller details right there. That'll be really interesting to fill in. You know, coloring in the lines is still very, very therapeutic, even if you're, uh, even if you're an adult, it's still very therapeutic. Looks like that guy's got an apple in his mouth. Got some, uh, little guys around here hugging on the llamas. Right here we have a connect the dot, which was one of my favorite things to do as a kid. Um, I wasn't very good at, um you know, drawing, so filling in the dots or connecting them was something I really <laughs> enjoyed doing. And then the next one right here, we have uh, another scene. Looks as though he's talking to the cactus. It says, llamas and herbivores, can you find them a good snack? We're gonna give them a uh, turkey drumstick <laughs> and a soda pop. And then this side right here has a, another scene you can fill in. A lot of cactuses mixed in here, kind of interesting. And then the last one, it says, uh, help the llama find clothing. And then it ends right here, and it has the website right there if you want to check it out. Pretty cool. Very nice, very colorful, and very detailed book for coloring in. I'll actually probably take the time to do this, honestly. Like I said, it's very therapeutic, and taking the time to just, you know, enjoy the smaller things is very nice. Another thing this has right here is a little pack of stickers as well, which is really cool. So if we open right here... Looks as though we have multiple little stickers. There's one. We have this one. And then the last one right here. So what's really cool about this, sorry if you can hear my train passing by. We live next to a train and when it's cold, sound waves actually travel farther. So what's really cool about these is this is all just reused drawings. So you get an appreciation of all of the same art but uh, you could see what it looked like if it was actually colored in. It's actually actually pretty cool. 
probably give these to my fiance because she likes cute little stickers like this. She can put it on uh, some of her computer setup probably. But yeah, I think that this is a really interesting thing, especially if you're an adult and you still enjoy coloring, or if you're still younger and you want to pick this up as well, ask your parents about it. A huge shout out to my Patreons. Thank you guys so much for your support. You guys are awesome. If you enjoyed this video, found it interesting and maybe slightly nostalgic, feel free to slap that like button, comment, rate, and subscribe, or check out my Patreon in the description below. And I'll see you in the next video.